there's a height difference there. Woo! <laughs> So we're heading off to Bell Park because today um, in Canada it's National Aboriginal Day and pretty much everybody here is Aboriginal except for Matt. I'm white. So we're heading off to the powwow to go um, think. watch the powwow and see the vendors and stuff and get some cool stuff. So we will see you guys there. So we have to walk over to where the powwow is on the boardwalk, like we have to walk on the boardwalk to get there. I had to park at Science North because there's no parking over where it is and like Bell Park and Science North are connected. So we have to walk all the way over to where the powwow is and yeah, the kids are having a ball looking in the lake for fishies and talking about fish pee and duck pee. I don't know, don't ask. It's a big flower. Oh, wait, wait. Look. Now you can walk. Yes, because you can see a tadpole, Nick. They usually uh, go near shallow water. Hey, you. Well, what's a tadpole? Alex. Well, they eat a tadpole. Tadpole is a frog. Okay, let's go watch the dancing. Don't forget, you know, Andrew Travel could be a spot dancer if you want to earn a little bit of money. Next year. Good job, Nick. Ta so we're all done at the powwow. It's still going on, but we have to walk back to the cars now because I have to work at 3 o'clock today. Uh, or 3.30, so I have to leave for work soon. And yeah, so we're all walking back. We got all the kids dancing except for Emma, pretty much. And yeah, did you have fun, Alex? No. Why? He didn't dance. He did dance. He what? You wanted to what? Eat. Well, we're gonna eat when we get home. Grace, let's go. So it's work time for me, and uh, hopefully Matt will be vlogging while I'm at work. And yeah, I'll see you guys when I get home from work. It's kind of dark. Hey guys, how's it going? So, Nikki lost her keys, and uh, I found them now. But, I went out to check in the car, if they were there, and, uh, yeah, but the alarm went off for about a good five minutes before I was able to shut it off, and when I came back in, then I found her keys underneath a few things of clothes on the kitchen table. Now, we have a key rack. I'm just as bad for this. Right here right by the door where we're supposed to hang them but we don't so tonight I guess it just kicked me in the butt looking like a maniac outside at um well 9 30 tonight having the car alarm blaring so yeah, uh, other than that, it's uh, been a quiet night. Uh, Ariel has a pretty red sunburn on the back. Well, on her back. Um, let's see, Nikki's at work for another hour and a half. And then she's up at the hospital because she's having issues with her arm. Something's going on. She can't move it the full range of motions anymore so she's gonna get that looked at finally it's only been five, like five days so yeah um I'm probably gonna tidy up the mess I just made looking for these keys 
because you know you throw things around when uh, car alarms are going off. I'm trying to shut it off as quick as possible, but nope. Thankfully, I got some tools handy, and I was able to shut off the alarm. Won't say how. Might get in trouble if I say how. Probably get in trouble now just for saying this, but. Oh well, I did it. It went off. I shut off. It's hooked back up. That kind of gives it away right there. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so I'm just going to be uh, tidying up a little bit and uh, waiting for Nikki to get back. Um, we'll let you know when she comes back from work or perhaps maybe she'll just like take off to the hospital or whatever but either no it, either way we'll let you know uh so yeah we'll see you then <laughs> <laughs>